good evening. I want to suck your blood. Actually, no, I don't. I want to teach you how to act like a vampire. None of this new age vampire rubbish. I'm going to show you how to do proper old school Dracula. Step one, style. As you've noticed, old school bling. Let's go Baroque people. Covent Garden's the best place to go for something a little outré, a little recherché. Okay, so once you've got your little bit of vampiric bling, you're going to need the outfit. Think corsets, dark skirts, thick black tights. If you're a man, tuxedos, baby, tuxedos. I'm going to teach you how to stalk. Now, you're going to need a cape for this, but a towel or a sheet will do in a pinch. So, bring your cape around to the front of you, like so, stick your elbow out, and stalk. Remember to get up on the balls of your feet and move with purpose. Okay, once you've mastered the stalk, you have to master the hiss. Now this goes well on the end of a stalk, but it also goes well towards someone. For example, <laughs> remember, no vampire is actually a stuffed suit. You've got to move fluidly, like a dancer. Ripple. Okay, so, forward, out, and back. <laughs> A further note on teeth. If you're like me and you're lucky to have natural vampiric fangs, then you've nothing to worry about. But if not, you can always purchase a pair of these. So, we're going to stalk and we're going to hiss together. Cape at the ready. So, you've got the stalk and the hiss. Next, it's the bite. When you're going to bite someone, you have to get hold of them by the head, put your hand on their shoulder. This will expose this part of the neck, the ideal place to bite. But unless it's a willing participant, don't bite too hard. You don't want to get arrested. So, hold the head, push on the shoulder, and bite. <laughs> Step four is accent. Very important. No vampire, well, no old school proper vampire. Sounds like they're from America or Essex, for example. So, you've got to go Transylvanian. I want to suck. Remember, all U sounds become A sounds and all W sounds become V sounds. So instead of I want to suck your blood, it becomes, I want to suck your blood. And remember to wave your arms around too. Remember what I said about movement. So that's step one, style. Step two, stalk. Step three, hiss. Step four, bite. Step five, accent. And I'm gonna talk about step six, avoidance. Don't touch one of these. If you do, react as if you've just been burnt. For example, <laughs> it's a good opportunity for another hiss as well. Also, garlic. Now this is an excuse to stay away from people who've just been eating garlic bread. Not just because their breath stinks, but you're a vampire. You can't go anywhere near it. <laughs> Again, another good excuse for a hiss. Now, this you will all recognise. It's holy water. 
anathema to your vampiric soul. Avoid it at all costs. <laughs> and that is how you act like a vampire. Ah!